Hey everybody, John Bash from Motocross Action here. We are out at Racetown for one of the most anticipated days of the year. It's our MXA 254 stroke shootout. Six bikes behind me. We're going to put them to the test. We brought out six riders. We have Chris Zobel, Austin Politelli, Ty Hames, Daryl Eklund, Dennis Stapleton, and Lee Witt. Starting off with the Suzuki number 61, they added separate function forks, uh, they made engine revisions, uh, a new transmission, and then they did the plug and play couplers. The Kawasaki received a revised engine, plug in couplers as well, uh, a narrower frame, 4 millimeters narrower, like the Kawasaki 450, uh, larger forks, new styling, similar to the 450, and wider grips. The KTM, most changed bike uh, of the six pack, has an all new en engine, a uh, new transmission and exhaust among many other things. Husqvarna, they went with strengthened radiators, new mapping, uh, in mold graphics and different grips. Honda, stiffer fork springs, larger fork pistons, revised EFI settings and new tires. Uh, the new Dunlop rear tire, the MX-51 FA, is actually 0.9 pound lighter than a traditional MX-51. And the Yamaha, uh, they went with aesthetics. Uh, you'll notice the, the new graphics, the black handlebars, and the white rear fender. Everybody knows that Daryl likes to get taken out. Number 75. <laughs> <laughs>